What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Data up here and welcome back to Stardew Valley. I am still getting over my cold, so if I still sound a little bit funny, that would be why. But, we have some very exciting thing... Things? I was gonna say things, but it's just one thing. A horsey! On our farm! We have a horse! Uh, and... Uh, name. I should have thought about this. Um, let's name our horse. I guess I'm gonna name all of my pets after... Uh, not my sister's pets, but Atlas, our dog, is one of my sister's dogs, and when my sister was younger, she used to ride horses, and was very into horses, and I remember one of the horses that she rode, and it's actually the only one I remember, was, and I hope this will fit, um, should we make it one word? Yeah, we'll do one word, Applejack. I think that's a nice name, Applejack. We're gonna make this horsey a boy since Grover was its default name, so it's probably a male. Speaking of male, D-Dub, <laughs> I'd like to buy a pumpkin from you. My daughter and I want to carve a jack-o'-lantern for the upcoming Spirits Eve Festival. Caroline. Sure thing, Caroline. No problem. Can do. Will do. All the above. Um, inventory full. Oh yeah, we still have this mess to take care of. Let's do that real quick. Much better. That's a much more beautiful sight. Okay, Applejack, come here. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is so much faster. I love this. And to hop off and on, we just right click. Super easy and convenient. I love it. I gotta start remembering to use this guy to travel like everywhere. Because one thing that this game lacks is the, an ability to call your horse to you. So if you leave your horse somewhere, uh, you better hope you remember where you left it, because otherwise, uh, that's not a functional gate anymore. Um, okay, so our farm is starting to degrade, or at least the fences and gates on our farm. I don't think gates actually ever degrade, but when they don't have a fence post attached on either side, uh, they break. So, we're not going to fix it quite yet. We might wait until winter, actually, to fix it. But we will be fixing it, and in order to fix it, we're going to be replacing it with hardwood fences. Um, you don't get anything back from damaged fences, I don't believe, so there's really no point in, like, hoping to get all this wood back and remaking them, because it's degraded and it's been placed. Heck, after placing them, or after having them placed for, what, five seconds, if that, you don't get anything back from them? So, definitely after three months, or I guess only a month and a half, we plan, or we... I was just going to say we planted these fences. We placed these fences in on summer one, I believe, or very soon after. Uh, but anyway, today is going to be an interesting episode because we're going to be taking care of a, just a lot of little things here and there. Um, I don't even know what all those things are yet, just to give you a, an honest heads up. What was I doing in here? Grabbing something to put in in our in our thingy. Uh, let's do hot peppers. Why not? We got a lot of them. It can't hurt, right? Pickled hot peppers. Sounds delicious. Um, I'm thinking we might go buy another cow today, actually. Um, I want to breed them once I have two. But I'm okay with buying two, just so they have some company. Because Maya and... Be this isn't Bella. I was going to say Bella. Maya and Darcy have each other's company. But Bella doesn't have anyone's company. Yes, she has the other two, now three, ladies, now that we have Hannah, but they don't they don't communicate very well because Bella speaks cow and everyone else speaks chicken and duck, which is like, duck is like a, a sub-dialect of chicken, uh, whereas cow is just a completely different language. So, uh, <laughs> we need to get someone that also speaks cow, right? So that Bella isn't lonely. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and start or resume my daily hardwood chopping. Because I want to save up enough hardwood that we can easily and not totally exhaust our hardwood supply. Uh, to replace all fence on our farm. At least all wood fence with hardwood. Because I think that could be a nice addition. And I believe hardwood fences last like a year, whereas regular fences only last, like, 45 days, maybe? That sounds about right. 
But anyway, I'll finish this up real quick. And I'll meet you guys right now. Okay, so now that that's taken care of. Ooh, these are ready. I did not realize that. Um, Do we have enough time to plant these? Heck, we might as well, right? What harm is it going to do? Um, Hello, Atlas. How are you? Yeah, doing well? All right. Um, I was putting away all my items in my inventory, and I noticed these three were sitting right next to each other. And that reminded me that I'm pretty sure we need those for something. Yes, we can do cheese and honey and an apple, all for the artisan bundle. And then I believe an apple also goes to here, three apples to the fodder bundle. So we're going to actually try and contribute to this as well today. Uh, 10 pieces of hay and 10 wheat and an apple. Uh, so let's grab out 10 pieces of hay. Uh, we are going to be stopping by the community center if that isn't apparent yet. Uh, we need to put one there, two up there, an apple and cheese. All that's going. Uh, we're going to be dropping off this stuff at Clint and uh, Gunther's. And a couple other things, if we have time. It's going to be a busy episode. I actually, in all honesty, have zero notes for today's episode. Because I was feeling so bad last episode I recorded, I didn't even feel like doing the note portion of the episode. So I didn't. Um, one thing about a horse is you can't fit in a one wide space. Normally we can walk through this. You can't do that on a horse. So you got to kind of go around. Which reminds me, I should probably build a path soon that actually leads to the south end of our farm. That's something I meant to do a long time ago, and and just, it didn't, to be completely honest with you. All right, hello, Marnie. We have, it's not her, no, it's not her birthday. It was her birthday not long ago. Let's give her some honey. Oh, we've already given her enough, apparently. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wonder if Mr. Lewis gets lonely in that big house of his. It seems so empty in there, doesn't it? Oh, not when you're there, Marnie. Not when you're there. Okay, let's add ourselves another dairy cow. A milk powder is acquired, lives in the barn. Cool, we got the money. It's not expensive. And, like I said, ooh, we can get how now brown cows. Look at that. Oh, yeah, cool. Okay, Zopi. No, thank you. Gru, Re, Fabel, Jope, Kaboo, Wover, Gronu. What kind of names are these? I have no idea. Uh, we've got Bella, and I don't know why, but having only two cows, I think Annabelle would be a beautiful name. I really like that name. You can go by Anna, Ann, Bell, Bella. It's There's just so many nicknames for it, and I love it. Little Annabelle. It's so cute. Okay. We don't even... Eh, we'll say hi to Annabelle later. She's got... Her sister slash mama, however you want to view it, uh, to look after her in the meantime. Hi, D-Dub. Hi, Leah. Stop at my cabin if you ever need someone to talk to. <gasps> Ooh, she's got the little... I'd show you it again. Uh, she had a little red dot next to her, which means she likes us. We don't get that on Marnie because she's not single, even though she is single, but she's not an eligible bachelorette. So, And we need to be given gifts. You get a sunflower. This is a really nice gift. Thank you. You're welcome, Leah. You might get the rest of our sunflowers since I know you appreciate them. Or Caroline. I think it was Caroline that liked them too. But we're not trying to woo Caroline. We're trying to woo Leah. So she'll probably get them. Okay, now that we have our horse, we can speedily head over to Clint's before he closes at five and the museum. Can I get through here? I can get through there. Okay. I got to relearn all the routes I can run on Applejack. Which I love. Also, there's a pumpkin there. I'm just not seeing that. That's cool. Oh my gosh. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. We also probably should have done that. We'll take care of that tomorrow. Oh, he closes at four. I just made a liar out of myself. Okay, so even despite Applejack... Well, I guess Applejack can't compensate for my bad judgment. Which is entirely what that was. But let's go ahead and donate this... What was it called? A chewing stick? I think that can go over there. Why not? And that's all we have to donate because I'm a scrub. That's okay, though. But I love this. Can we talk to people? 
Not really. Fall is a sad time of year for me. Sorry, I had to cough. Why? Is she lonely? I don't know you. I can kind of relate to that, though. Fall is kind of depressing. Oh, no. Mom's making lots of soup tonight. Um, especially, I don't know. It get, It's the cold weather, and it just kind of, it's the first time it gets cold, and it kind of puts a damper on everything. And if it's a beautiful fall day, sure. But if it's, like, gloomy and cold, and everything's dying around you, and uh, tree-wise, <laughs> I didn't mean for that to be as morbid as it sounded. Uh, but it, it, I don't know. It can be kind of depressing sometimes. My legs are stiff from sitting at my writing desk all morning. What do you write? I don't know. I think he's working on some sort of novel. I don't know what, though. And man, we really took an energy penalty today, or from last night. All we did was water our crops, and then that that's really it. Cut hardwood. But I promise, I will get these controls down for riding a horse. I keep opening my inventory to try to get off of it. That's not how it works. But I will get it down. Is that it? Two pieces of coral? I probably missed something. Oh well. It don't matter. Okay. Um, five o'clock. No energy. Uh, we can run by the community center still. And this is new, I think. Shrimp? A scavenger that feeds off the ocean floor wildly not wildly, widely prized for its meat. Still, wildly and widely prized, those are both good things. If you really want to get the fish biting, make sure you put some bait on your hook. Yeah, we'll do. Thank you, sir. Okay. Oh, and it's Friday night. Oh, you know what that means. I'm glad I I'm glad I noticed that. It's time to get our bar on. Let's go. Hello, patrons of Stardew Valley slash Pelican Town. I've been working hard all week. I deserve a little relaxation on Friday nights. Hello, husband and wife. Have you met the wild man that lives behind our house? I have. His name is Linus. I guess I don't really mind, as long as he doesn't bother us. Mara sure spends a lot of time working on those gadgets of hers. Yeah, she probably takes after you, Demetrius. I'm glad she's so dedicated. Alright, what's up, chit? Ch I was about to say chids. That is children and kids mashed up into one word. Um, did he say this all? Maybe I should let Sam win. Yeah. All the same stuff to say. Wow, I just realized it's Friday. Sometimes I totally lose track of time. Uh, we'll play these arcade games soon. We're not quite to winter yet, but I'm saving that for winter. They're pretty fun. And I'm probably going to be terrible at them, so that might be enjoyable to watch. <laughs> Handling salty fish all day really makes me thirsty. Uh, everyone else we've already talked to. Maru is now no longer able to talk to us. because Not Maru. Marnie. Oh, we've heard that before. Yep, and that. Marty doesn't seem to notice that you're there, because she's so preoccupied. With empty house man, Mr. Lewis. Okay, you all say the same thing. Too, it's a pity it'll be over soon. Blah, blah, blah. Have we been up here before? I don't know if we have. Uh, I, Yeah, actually, I think we have. This is, I guess, just their dining room. Ooh. 7 o'clock, the lights come on. Good to know. Not really, though. And then this is Gus's bedroom. Ooh! Are we good enough friends with Gus? I think so. I think we are. Cool. Um, actually, I guess we could just find out, right? Uh, Gus, three hearts. Cool. I didn't know that. I'm thinking... I'm trying to come up with stuff already uh, that we can do in winter to not make it so just dead um because there's a lot of dead time in winter uh i don't mind it at all but when trying to make content of it that's a completely different story like it's a lot of mining and fishing and you guys know i skip the fishing and i make time lapses out of the mining so there's really not a lot of content there unless you want to see like a four day time lapse of me just mining which i don't think you do so i'm trying to come up with stuff to do and I'm I'm making I'm making my list, uh, but if you guys have any suggestions that maybe I might not have thought of yet, uh, feel free to let me know. Upgrading all of our tools, uh, mining, fishing, that's all on there, obviously. But also playing the games, uh, befriending more villagers, doing a little bit more foraging, and one thing I want to do is go through everyone's houses and kind of 
inspect the interior of their house. And I know that sounds... Dang it, I did it again. I know that sounds really lame, uh, but there's actually a lot of a lot of lore hidden away in people's houses and, like, in all the items that you can inspect and stuff. So, so yeah. Um, also, tomorrow's Saturday, and I'm looking here at my notes from last episode, actually, and I made a list of all the different uh, items, or not items, things that can be built uh, from Robins, and I'm seeing them some things that I might want to build. Um, adding another silo could not hurt. So let's actually grab the materials for that. Um, because I did say we're going to need another to make it through winter. Uh, it's 100 stone, 10 clay, and 5 copper bars. Which I know we have. And 100 gold. Which is not exactly difficult. Uh, so we'll put all these down here. Let me just sell some of this stuff because I'm going to get super confused otherwise. There's too much stuff going on. And there's that black crow or whatever that is. Uh, we'll save these. I don't know if we have room for this. Yeah. We don't. Um. What do I sell of this? Anything? I don't know if I want to sell any of this stuff. Uh, we could pull this out and use it. Because that doesn't need to be long-term storage. This does, though. Are there any other... That's our only other piece of tackle we got? Interesting. I guess we'll hang on to that for when this runs out. Which, I need to do more fishing for that to run out. And that might be how I end the day. Um, just to just to get it out of the way. And do a little bit of reorganizing. Grab our copper bars. And... There we go! Materials. We have a lot to take care of tomorrow. Uh, we'll probably take care of the uh, the community center tomorrow because we're going to have to head that direction anyhow. So I don't really need to make a trip there tonight. But I will meet you guys right back here. I'm going to go fish the rest of my day away. And I'll see you in just a sec. Okay, nothing too exciting. All we got was two chub and three bream. Again, nothing too exciting. But good night, Applejack. You are my favorite newest addition. Not playing favorites or anything, but I totally kind of am. Because that's a game changer for me. Alright. Good night, Atlas. Good night, everyone. Let's go to bed and start a brand new day. Which, again, we have a couple things that I wanted to do yesterday that we didn't get done that we're going to tackle today. I'd also like to go mining, if we can. Which, don't let me forget, I need to bring a chest with me because I totally scrubbed on that one. Uh, last time I was there and destroyed it and let it go into the water. Um, today is cloudy with gusts of wind. Tomorrow will be cloudy with gusts of wind. Gusts of wind. I think I've said gust of winds in the past. Sorry if I have. <laughs> and the spirits are in good humor, so that's good. Maybe we'll tell them some jokes or something. Who knows? Okay. Um, one thing to note about, uh, what are they called? Tackle. I don't think I've mentioned it. They do have durability. You can see the durability bar there has gone down. Um, they actually don't last too terribly long. But... And look at this. Applejack is such a good boy. He goes back to his stable whenever he's left out overnight. Which is, like, all the time. <laughs> there we go. All right. I'm going to take care of... Actually, hold on. We got a lot of... A lot of grapes. I think it's just grapes. Yeah, it's definitely just grapes. Ooh. Okay, not hold on. What is that? Is that... Is that our ancient seed that we planted? I think that's what that was. Ooh, we're gonna go find out what that is, guys. I'm excited. I've never planted one of those before. So I honestly have no idea what that is. Let's find out. We can't even use this entrance because everything has deteriorated. Ooh, what is this? We're not going to find out right now. We're going to water first, and then we'll go find out. I'm such a tease. I know, right? I don't know why I'm in such a good mood right now for being sick, and like I can't breathe through my nose, but somehow I'm in a good mood. That, that rarely ever happens. Ancient fruit. It's been dormant for eons. That, I believe, is the most valuable crop in the game. I'm pretty sure. 
So that's going right out here with our star fruit. And we have the ability to make it, right? Uh, where is it? I'm looking for the seed maker. Uh, it's up here. Wood, coal, gold bar. Uh, that's happening right now. I didn't even see the numbers of those things, but it was like 25 coal, one gold bar, something like that. Something close to that. What was it? 25 wood, 10 coal, one gold bar. Oh, that's so happening right now. Can we? Yeah, we're making two. 10 coal, two gold bars, and 50 wood. Do we even have that? I know we don't have a lot of wood. We have 373 wood. Just kidding. Okay, let's make two of those real quick. Um, For the sake of populating this area, we'll definitely be moving them later. What am I doing? All the wrong tabs, apparently. Uh, let's go ahead and place these right here. Um, sure, why not? These will be moving, um, again, probably in winter. I've got a lot of things I want to take care of in winter. And I'm trying to save stuff that I can just do in winter for then that aren't a priority. So that'll be happening in winter. So let me run and grab our uh, star fruit and ancient fruit. Oh, I like that. And put these in the seed maker. Because, oh man, and there's a slight, slight chance of a seed maker giving you, where are they? Mixed seeds, I'm pretty sure, instead of what you put into it. So if that happens, I'm going to cry. Um, but we're we're risking it to get the biscuit. You kind of have to do that sometimes. Also, I'm realizing we need a way to get down here with our horse. That's not terrible. Uh, which this currently is. I can't even go through that. So that was all that we could harvest, right? No corns ready today. I always seem to miss that. And I said I was... Ah, dang it. I said I was going to be better about it, so let me be better about it. Okay, uh, Applejack can't even fit through down here. So currently, the only way to get our horse out the south end of our farm is to go all the way around. We can't even get through here, can we? Yeah, we can. Okay. It's to go all the way around the pond to this side, which is incredibly annoying. That's going to have to change uh, again, probably in winter. Okay, now we can check on our animals. That's a, a, a pain. Oh, hi, Annabelle. Okay, so it says in their name tag how old they are. Baby or not baby. So Annabelle is currently a baby, and Bella is clearly an adult, as she has been for a little while now. So we can still only milk Bella. But soon, I don't know how long it takes. Not too long, I don't believe. Soon, we should be able to get milk from both. Ooh, I think that's our first silver quality, silver quality milk. Exciting. Not that I don't think it matters, but okay. How do we get, I need, what was it? 10 pieces of hay uh, for that bundle. Uh, artisan, no, it's bulletin board, fodder, 10 pieces of hay. Um, can I even get that out? One. I can, but do I have to keep pulling it? Eight, ten. There we go. That's weird. It'll only pull the amount of animals that you have in that room, I guess is how that works. Also, where are my... Where is my chick? I can only see one of my chickens right now. Uh, there's one. Somewhere. <laughs> Hannah's hiding out, but I don't see Darcy. Where is she? Oh, she's hiding up here. Sneaky little girl. Also, did we come in here yesterday? We definitely did not. That's a lot of eggs. Very exciting. Very exciting indeed. Uh, let's go ahead and just pop two of these in. It don't matter. Which two? Not really. And we'll sell the rest. Oh, we got a lot of stuff on us. Okay, we've spent entirely too much time on the farm. Did I put my milk pail up? Yes, I did. Okay. Um. Let me out. 
Okay, we're gonna sell all this stuff real quick and then see if we can't visit Caroline since they're open today. We'll stop by there. We'll stop by... Oh, I'm so glad I... Woo, that was fast. That was real fast. Okay, and we got three of each? Oh, that's awesome. I love that. Okay, cool. These are going to have to go in... Well, obviously, these can only be planted in summer. And these... I don't think grow in winter. I think they're grow or they're able to be harvested spring, summer, and fall. But not winter. So we can't plant these yet. We need a greenhouse for those, for sure. Um, is there anything that is low enough quality that we want to save? No, I don't believe so. So let's get our cell on. Although we should have saved those grapes. And we will. We'll just hang on to them. Uh, the mayo goes. The eggs go. And that's it. We got a lot of junk on us. But we're about to get rid of a lot of it. Um, I guess we'll... I will get better at that. I promise. Guess we'll grab the bait. Because why not? And let's head out. I should have gone up. Um, oh well. We're going to stop by the community center first, and then Robins, and then the mine, and hopefully, 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 we can get to level 100 today. That is the goal. We were so close last time, but so far away at the same time. And I forgot the wood for our chests. I said I was going to remember, and I didn't. Oh, well. That's whatever. Okay, fodder bundle. Apples. Oh, you need all three? I thought you could just partially do it. No, apparently not. Okay, so we've got our wheat and our hay for over here. Oh my gosh, sorry. Coughing fits are the worst. Um, And then we've got... Is it over here? No, it's not our animal bundle. It's our artisan bundle. We can do our honey, an apple, and cheese. And I guess we have one extra thing of cheese and one extra apple which we can eat for food if needed if we run out of space because we clearly don't have a chest we can put stuff in also we are so close to completing this uh we we make jelly all the time and we have cloth we have two things of cloth in our chest and so we just need a fruit tree and we're done with this bundle or just a random piece of fruit from, like, the mines or something. Because that can randomly happen, I think. That is really cool. We're closer than I thought. Okay. Um, I'm remembering that I wanted to stop by Clint's and the museum. And we're going to do that. And read this book. Which is new and exciting. Okay. Let's hope we can get all this done in time. I think we can. I believe in us. Also, Caroline... So many things. Where is she at? Please tell me she's in here. Because I'm wasting time right now otherwise. Is she in her kitchen? Caroline. I wanted you to be here. Why aren't you here? Be better. Do better. Oh, man. That's a bummer. Pierre, we don't have time for you right now, sir. I apologize. If we see Caroline, I'm not going to make an, a huge effort to find her. Uh, just for time's sake, because I really want to get level 100. Can we get through here? No, we can't. Oh my gosh. Applejack, I love you, but lose some weight, man. Please. I think we can go this way, though. Yeah, we can. Okay. Oh, right. Just in time, too. We have 30 minutes before Clint closes. We can still say hi, though. Sometimes I wonder how I ended up in this town. Okay. Geodes. So many geodes. Oh my gosh. We got some new things. Uh, Neptunite. Barite. Star shards. I think we already have pyrite. But that's a lot of new stuff. At least three, I believe. If I'm not mistaken. Which I very well could be. Donate to the museum? All of those are... And this? I don't even remember what this was, but... Cool. I'm going to stop caring as much about how this looks. They're all just 
rocks. I'm still going to try to do the cemetery, but not with, like, colors or any of that. No rewards? Are you serious? Did this give us two entries? What? Journey of the Prairie King, the smash hit video game. Did you know, anyone who beats Journey of the Prairie King is automatically entered into a drawing for a special prize? Did you know, the developer has stated that the protagonist is based on a real-life character, a true cowboy hero from a prairie island, prairie island in the Gem Sea. This is one of the games at uh, the saloon, by the way. A study on diamond yields. After years of research in the mines, I believe I've learned something about diamond frequency. My research involved only the stones that are scattered about the mines, the ones that are broken with a pickaxe. Mineral yields from other sources require more research. Diamonds seem to only form at mine level 50 or greater. At level 50, approximately 1 in 500 stones will be diamond rich. After level 50, the frequency of diamond formation seems to increase by about 0.000016 per level. Quite a rare gem. Jasper. That's pretty... I'm pretty sure that's all like very accurate info. Uh, those are like the statistical drop rates of diamonds or spawn rates. And I'm pretty sure when they say the study, they studied rocks for it, um, it's like what's the chance that a regular rock node will actually be a diamond node? Not that breaking open a regular stone rock will yield something better. I could be wrong, but also, hello, Caroline. Oh, the pumpkin. It's a good one. Abigail will be so happy when she sees this. Thanks, D-Dub. And then she goes to talk bad about Abigail. Come on. That's not very... Well, I guess she's her mom, so... It fits. Okay. And then the last thing that I almost forgot again. See if we can get to Robins in time. And Applejack might be making this happen for us. Can we do it? Oh. We can. 450. Uh, construct farm building. Add us another coop. Not coop. Silo. Please. And as far as the location goes. Um. I don't have a clue where I want this. It's going to look very out of place here. We're going to do it. Because why not? But. Actually. Just for the time being. Oh, look at that. I can't even. Oh, man. Okay. I guess we're not going to have her move our other silo. I wanted to move it right next to that one because there was a perfect opening for it. But no. Robin said nope. Oh, my gosh. We have so much stuff on us. Okay. Okay. Let's get mining ready. This is going to be a mess when we're done. Just a heads up. But all right. Let's see if we can't get to level 100. Let's go. Goodness! I don't know if... Oh my gosh. This is going to be a problem. Now our horse is back there. Um, Applejack, we will come get you tomorrow. Um, that five-level chunk is so freaking difficult. 
I don't know why I can't get through it. I budgeted. I, I started at like, what, 5.30? And went till 1, pretty much? That is insane. And we didn't even get that, get that much stuff out of it. Like, I, I don't mean to complain here, but that's really not a lot. It wasn't really worth all that <laughs> effort. Um, are we saving any of this? Yeah, we are. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's time for bed. That was a struggle. I will get through that one of these days, but today is not that day. We got level 7 combat, though. New crafting recipe, Ring of Yoba. What is that? Anything that'll give us more, like, defense or more, even more attack damage. Something combat-related. I'm okay with giving up our magnet ring for that next time we go mining because, my goodness, that level's hard. Uh, what is that? Actually, can we make anything that's good? Warrior energy after slaying a monster. That could be good. Sturdy ring. That's also good. Ring of Yoba occasionally shields the wearer from damage. That sounds like a winner. Yeah, we can also craft life elixir? Huh, I didn't know that. Cool. Anyway, that's where we're going to end it for today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, as always. When we get back next time, I don't know what we're going to do. I'll figure that out. Uh, hopefully, I'll make some notes so we'll have a little bit more uh, concrete plans. But other than that, that's all I've got for you guys today. So thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. And until then, as always, take care.